Hello, so we are back and this time we have a nice laptop to repair. Check here, it's a Dell laptop XPS. Hmm? So what this laptop is doing, let's uh, read the customer email. The customer is a computer shop. Dell XPS, uh, when the customer, when plugging customer Dell charger into the laptop, the light on the charger goes off. Does mean, for me, it looks like something is shorted there. Laptop does turn on, goes off after a few seconds. Suspect battery flat. I believe that's, uh, that's right. So probably it's coming on and goes off because it's uh, discharged. And laptop is not charging. Try another charger, but no lights come on uh, to the laptop to say it is charging. So uh, we are looking for uh, uh, input circuit issue. Yeah. So what I will check first, let's check the charging port, just to be sure the charging port is good. And you know what, for me the charging port looks fine. I mean, I can't see any issue with the, with the charging port. Probably you can't see because the, the case is shiny. But I can see the port looks fine. So I'll say, let's plug a charger and see what it's doing. I have the USB-C, we have the power meter. So plug in the charger. And it's doing nothing. Like nothing. Okay, let's open the laptop quickly and have a look inside. Okay, so the laptop is open. And it's looking nice inside. Let's unplug the battery. And I just want to check to be sure the main power rail is fine, it's not shorted. So the main power rail, which probably has to be on the capacitors, and it's not shorted. Capacitor. No, I can't see the main power rail shorted. Capacitors, then we have, oh, we have, no, it's fine. So the main power rail is not shorted. Okay, let's focus on the charging port. So what do we have on the charging port? We can't see a lot. But I want to check this. And this one is fine. Yeah, because here is ground, and I was thinking this is some dialed, but it's fine, it's no issue. So why this is not working? Where is our PD controller? Let's see what we have on the motherboard. So this is the heatsink, or what is this? This piece of plastic over the MOSFET. Yeah, possible. So we have the capacitors, and we have zero ohms. Check on the screen, zero ohms. So the main power LED is shorted, I think. Let me check with ground. With ground, short. On the other side is short. So the main power LED is shorted. Yeah, probably this is the main power LED here. This is an inductor. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to comb with the power supply. For me, it looks like a shorter capacitor because we have like zero ohms there. Uh, we have 0 0.9 on the, on the power supply. Good. Let me grab the thermal camera. Now, let's see what can be here. Maybe we can fix it quickly. Let me lower the current on the power supply. Yeah, that's fine. So, we need a ground on somewhere. Oh, lol, here is another charging port. I didn't know that. We have one USB-C here, one USB-C here. So ground, the best place to take the ground probably is from the charging port. No, we can't. Uh, I think I have to hold the ground somewhere, right? Yeah, it is short, you can see. So let me try to do it. Yeah, like that. Good. What is there? Uh -huh. uh, I'm not sure where the camera is looking. But for me, it looks like a shorter capacitor. Yeah, there. Oh, lol, it is a capacitor. I can't believe. <laughs> Easy money. <laughs>
Okay, so we have the capacitors here, both capacitors. Let's come with some alcohol. Alcohol. Coming with the power supply, with the current. Just pay attention on the capacitor. Check there. You can see it's the first one. Good. Let's remove that capacitor quickly. Let me do it so I don't melt. Uh, we have a connector next to the capacitors. Yeah. Let's remove it. Yeah, it's still, we still have a capacitor there, which is fine. Let me cool down the board quickly. Do we still have short on the main power rail? Let's see. No, no short. So I'm gonna plug the battery. Let me plug the charger. And now we do have light on the on the charging port and we do have the charging light there. The laptop is taking 19 volts, but no current. Yeah, check that. One amp. Can you see the current is going up? That's mean it's charging fine. So the laptop is charging with 1.1 amps. I left it a little bit on charge. And we have Dell, we have picture. I can't believe. The current is 1.7, 1.9, 2 amps. Let's wait and see if it's loading the windows. Hard drive not installed. Okay, yeah. The, the, the cast, they, they took out the hard drive. They took out the hard drive. Yeah, but that's not our problem, you know. The hard drive not installed. Let me shut it down. So I believe we are fine. On this port is charging with 1.1 amps. And here, she will charge with the same amount of current. 19, let's wait. Yeah, 1.1 amps. Okay, so I believe this is fixed, yeah? We can call this a repair. Now, just have in mind, you know, it's a part what you check when you are looking to fix uh, a laptop, yeah? First, main power L, if it's not short, if you have voltage. Then if the main power rail is present, the next step is uh, checking the 3.3 .3 volts. And the easiest way to check the 3.3 .3 is on the power button. Okay, so I'm going to stop now. I will say uh, thank you for watching. You know, just like, subscribe if you like the video, and uh, see you on the next one. Bye.